ultimately what I noticed was it's groups of people, catalysts of people, and, and you know, you know, be it gay marriage or be it universal coverage, there was a shared principle. Everybody has shared responsibility to keep this thing going. Business, individuals, government, and government from the state to the federal and even local communities as well. And that's how we've kept it together. And, it bo and that the, sa and the same premise happened with the criminal justice legislation. It went all over on, in so many different things. When, there, when we started, there might have been eight provisions. The, the, we ended up with 15 to 17, and it was because you had all these different interests and different people that came to it, and they were such complex pieces that you tried to, you tried to, you tried to understand who were the constituents and who were the people that were most effective, and at the same time, try and figure out where can you land at so that you can end up with the biggest, most, uh, over, most um, expansive reach so that you can do wholesale reform, but at the same time so that you're not focusing on the individual, I'm sorry, you're not focusing on people as a, you know, like the war on drugs or the, the you know, I mean, to figure, you know, what are the monikers, right? We wanted to focus on how, did, how do we make sure that people are recognized as people and individuals, and it carried, it carried. And what I try and what I try and do everything is meet people where they're at.